almost half the number of blind people in the world come from India at 15 million. So when these three schoolboys were asked to build a device under the theme connecting people, they knew exactly whom they wanted to help. They want to use the technology to connect blind people using artificial intelligence and robotics to serve the society. Srikar, Anis and Parikshit took nearly a month to brainstorm on a product that could help integrate the visually challenged into society. And their research took them to Delhi's Pragati Maidan. So now see the walking and bam into a gutter. Where they realized that the braille trail there was causing more harm than help. Cracks and this installment. When we uh, finalized on doing the blind stick project, we went to see what facilities were there for the present white cane and you know why it has been serving its purpose for the past 10 years or so but now it isn't you know it has to go on it has to be more advanced and that's why we feel our stick has you know crossed that bridge another month of work under the guidance of their robotics head sanjay bansal and the communicane was ready it has three features a sound indicator and alarm for any obstruction on the road a voice navigator for audio directions attached to a cell phone and an emergency SMS that will go to an emergency contact if the cane falls. To see that a person who is really suffering from such difficulties was happy to you know, see our product, we, that time we felt, okay, we have made a difference, we have a potential to do something. So let me see how well this works. Welcome to Kabul with a cane system. I am ready to assist you. Watch out. A device like the Communicane is sure to help the visually challenged feel more independent and secure. Of course, there are many changes that still need to be made on this prototype before it's launched commercially in the market. But the first step has been taken and this time in the right direction. With camera person KK Rana in New Delhi, this is Priyanka Dubey.